Guys, Rich Carey is an absolute gentleman. And he's from Down Under. He's from Australia where they talk like this. It's really funny but kind of annoying at the same time. But we love him, really. Um, that was my really... That was my close, my best attempt at an Australian amazing, accent. Jack. You like it? Yes. You like it? Yes, I did. I need to get you to read me stories in Morgan Freeman's voice. Oh, yes. <laughs> Guys, throw it to Rich Carey, who's an incredible artist. Make sure you go check out his work, and he's actually going to show you a sneak peek of one he's been working on in the video right now. Rich, over to you, my man. Hello from Down Under, guys. How are you doing? I'm absolutely knackered. I've been uh, busy painting all day, so I'm wrecked. But enough about me. I've got a question for you. Um, I've been loving The Flash show, season one, season two. Both been amazing. I have one problem, though, one fear. Um, in season one, we have Reverse Flash. Season two, we've now got Zoom. These are the massive villains from the comic book. I'm a bit worried they used them too soon. Who are they going to use for the next few series? Um, are you concerned at all that they're going to run out by season six? Are they just going to have the second stringers as the villain? Um, or do you have an idea who could be the next major villain for the next few series? Cheers. Have a good one. Rich, very good point. Rich. Like yeah. we, we did bring that up just a few seconds ago as well about are they rushing into getting all the characters out there already? Yeah. My opinion already, and it has been ever since we saw Grad get sent to the beginnings and the makings of Gorilla City and Earth 2, that has been my bet for top runner for bad villain of season three. Mm -hmm. Devon? Uh, well, the thing is, there's a few more speedsters we can still we got use. The, yeah, we got the top. Yeah. We've got Mirror Master when it comes to the villains. Oh, yeah, anyway, right. yeah we got the Rogue yeah. Steel. We got, you know, Gorilla. Yep. We got um, Savitar, who would be a good one. Who would be cool uh -huh. to bring in. But if, that's gonna if cost Zoom a doesn't fortune. have any relation to Black Flash, we could technically use Black Flash still coming to, like, maybe bury Cheat's death and Black Flash is, like, Constantly you're supposed following to be him. mine type yep. deal. Because so he can never that. catch him, can he, Black Flash? Nah. I mean, I think he... I know Barry became Black Flash. <gasps> oh, what if Barry becomes Black Flash in the beginning of season three and then Wally got to take him down? What? Oh, my ah. God. Oh, so he dies. Team. Barry could almost die pretty much at the end of this season and then become Black Flash so that the third season start off. is like, boom, we got Black Flash, but now we have no Flash. So who needs to get their powers? Wally West needs to get his powers. Or they could do like a side story where in season three, it, let's say at the end of season two, Barry gets trapped in the Speed Force. He's fighting Savitar in the yes. Speed Force during season three. Escapes, gets Savitar, turns into Black Flash. Now Wally got to take him down. Banned, of course, with Arrow and all the other heroes and whatnot. And they got to outsmart him. CW writers, if you guys need any help writing the upcoming Flash seasons, you got Devon's your right man. Here. Don't worry about okay. that. Okay. <laughs> Devon's got seasons set up all throughout his head. So if you guys get stuck around about season four, season five, give Devon a call. He's got season nine through a hundred planned out and ready for you guys. Oh, I can so, keep this going. Oh, we got, we got more. We're going to create our own Flash episodes. Hey, you should do it. I'm going to get good at editing. You're going to be Black Flash. Wait, but you got to be prepared, though. There's going to be hashtag West Allen every episode. So There's at least going to be live. one make-out scene every with episode. West Allen every episode. Okay, I can live with that. Okay. I'll just cut it out in post. Anyways, <laughs> guys, who do you think is going to be our big villain for season three? Who do you, do you think? Do you agree with Rich? Do you think that maybe they're kind of cramming the, all the superheroes and all the big names in a little bit too quickly. Have they saved a final name that hopefully we'll see in season three, season four? Because I want The Flash to go on. Me too. Like, I want to see six, seven, eight seasons out of this show, man. Like, I really want this to do well. But like Rich said, are they going to have the content and the characters to fulfill it with? Guys, let us know what you think over on YouTube, over on Twitter, over on Facebook, so that we can constantly, we can carry this on for the next three weeks because nobody likes to go without a flash. If you want more from the Flash After Show, hit that button and subscribe to the stream.tv.